Hey everyone, it's Fan Art Friday. I hope you had a great uh, Thanksgiving last week because I sure did. I was the guy who made the turkey for uh, for our entire family. I think we had like um, God, like 15 people here, but we had like a 20. Uh, it was a 22 pound turkey, and I made it brown bag style. And if you never heard of brown bag style turkey, what it is is you take a turkey and you put some vegetables up its butt. You rub it down with olive oil, and then you put it in the pan, shove the pan and the turkey in a brown paper bag. And then you put the heat on, I think, 375, which is low enough not to burn the paper. You put it in the oven, you drizzle a little water on top of the paper bag, that way um, the steam can escape, and you cook it for like five hours, and it roasts the turkey. It is the juiciest turkey you've ever eaten. And I'm not saying, I'm not saying, I'm not trying to convince you to eat it this way, but, well, I already said it, it's the best turkey ever eaten. It's not some hillbilly style backwoods way of making turkey because, because no one here in Kentucky that I know has ever made a turkey that way. I just heard it on the radio a few years ago from Kid Craddock. He's dead now, um, but his turkey recipe lives on through me. <laughs> Uh, in this fan art picture, I am, uh, I'm a little nervous, by the way, on this commentary, because I haven't done a, like a, um, a, an art vlog commentary in, like, over, almost two months, um, I did submit the video, where it's on, the, it's on my YouTube channel, I did the video for, uh, the You Should Make a Webcomic number three, if you haven't seen that, go check it out, and, uh, uh you guys are already giving me ideas for a fourth installment, um, but uh, anyways, back back to this picture. I'm drawing Connie from Steven Universe, and um, if you follow my Twitter or my Tumblr, you seen that last week I I scribbled out a little concept sketch. See, I, see, I don't have a lot of time because I've been working like six days a week, fourteen hours a day, and when I get home, I'm really tired. Shower, eat, go to bed. But I was off sick um, in the middle of the week this week, and I had a chance to uh, take that concept sketch and to resketch it closer to. Um, to uh, the actual model, like their character models, and um, and then uh, after that, I went ahead and started inking in this old style of inking that I, I don't usually use anymore, uh, using the line tool and flash. And um, I wrote a tutorial up about it about five years ago. It was on DeviantArt. Well, it's still there. And um, I'm thinking about doing uh, redoing the tutorial, but in a video form. Hopefully, that would be entertaining and educational. Who knows? I don't even know if any of you guys even even use Flash for drawing. There's like just a handful of people anymore, seems like. But, um, anyways, back at it. Um, it's Connie sitting on a book, star behind her. Anyway, you get the idea. Um, you guys have been, uh, asking when Super Death Show is coming back, which, uh, for you that, for you that don't know, that's, um, it's my other vlog series where it's just centralizing uh, around me drawing my webcomic, uh, Danger Vision. And that should be back in January when I start the comic back. I'm sketching out concepts for future pages in the next chapter. Um, those are going on Twitter and on Tumblr if you want to check those out. And um, But yeah, Super Death Show should be back in 2016 in January. Um, so you'll get, um, uh, I guess more insight into my life on those. And, yeah, you know, if I do any more fan art that's, that I actually remember to record, then there'll be more of these fan art Fridays, too. Um, other than that, um, uh, some people have been asking about, uh, hosting webcomics and maybe building your own site. And, uh, I'm thinking maybe the next You Should Make a Webcomic would be about that, maybe... Maybe you should make a webcomic for building a website, but um, the only thing I, the only information I've really got to give on that is um, find a host, uh, pay for it, get a domain, install WordPress, install webcomic over top of WordPress, start posting comic. That's the only advice I got. Other than that. other than go over to Topastic, they seem like they've got a really good community. Every time I post anything over there, they're really nice to me, but I rarely ever post there because. The, the, the reason why I never post to Pastic is because I have to, <laughs> I have to, okay, when I, when I upload my comics to my website, 
uh, I always have a certain size. I have to down, I have to resize the comic, and I have to make a thumbnail for that actual image for that post. And that's the only problem I have with Topasic. Other than that, I love it. It's a great place. Um, I don't know why I just reviewed Topastic there, but hmm. Uh, one one last thing before I go because the time lapse is almost over. I hope you're enjoying it, by the way, and seeing this Connie thing. But one last thing is, uh, I would like to. I've, I've always wanted to be a part of a, a fanzine, like. Um, See, recently a Steven Universe fanzine just completed, and I think they're getting ready to ship books or something like that, and I didn't catch it in time. If I was able to get in on that, I would have done something way cooler, not something as simple as, like, Connie just sitting on a book with stars behind her, but I, w- I would have wanted to try to, you know, make something really cool for it, or, or you know, if there was a, I like to Adventure Time or Gravity Falls, I love those shows. Or hell, even even like regular show, that would be cool. I don't I don't see a lot of regular show fan art. But anyways, I would like to be a part of a fanzine, but I don't know how to find these fanzines. Um, I usually run across them after they're already completed, or all the slots are filled, and they're shipping books already, or whatever. But I never can run into a cool like Pokemon fanzine or something before you know before I'm not allowed to join it, you know? But, um, if you've got any ideas on that, uh, if you could leave a comment or something, I would be totally grateful. You can't see it, but I'm doing thumbs up right now. Okay, the... (laughs) Oh, by the way, um, earlier this week, I was rendering a video on my tower computer, and, uh, I walked out of the office to make a grilled cheese sandwich, and I came back, the room was filled with smoke, uh, and my computer was off, so I opened the window, and I waited a little while for the smoke to clear out, and uh, I opened the computer up, turned it on its side, <laughs> motherboard was burnt up, with the power supply plugs in, it was just fried, completely black, and I tried to unplug it, and <laughs> the motherboard just, <laughs> just pulled apart. Uh, anyways, uh, more vlogs and stuff. Super Death Show should come back, like I said, in January. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, subscribe to Super Death Show, this channel you're watching this on right here. If you want to see some more of my time lapses or hear me talk about stupid things like my life or whatever. Alright, bye.